The nationwide heroin epidemic is hitting close to home, and now the Pueblo community is trying to fight back. KRDO News Channel 13's Emily Allen is live outside the city's library where a meeting wrapped up tonight. The box when it comes to coming up with solutions to solving Pueblo's heroin problems. Now, the drugs are handled by the gangs. Armed with pens, paper. I know several people who are addicts. Questions. Um, that are using heroin. And experiences. I mean, when, I was, when I was a heroin addict. This group is fighting for a solution. Battle the drug. Battle the, the influence that it's had on the city. And I mean, if you look around Pueblo, it's taken a toll on the city, on the families. Luke Edwell won his fight with heroin. It reminds me that there's other people out there going through the same thing. But he says the city is losing to the drug. As a former heroin addict, I know how big of a, a deal it is here in Pueblo. It's difficult to measure the scope of the heroin problem here in Pueblo, but one health care professional thinks that it's much worse than people think. It seems to be getting worse, and that's what's scary about it. It's uh, We're going to lose a whole generation here. So that's why Dr. Michael Nuremberg is asking for help. We are spending a lot of time and a lot of resources spinning our wheels and getting nowhere. I think we need to look for something outside, outside the box ideas to get to this. And people like Alicia Fox are chipping in, brainstorming, and hoping to find an answer. I have several family members, um, people I love and care about, who have been affected uh, with this heroin epidemic. She says heroin is killing her city and her family. They're not the same people that you once loved. She says this meeting and this group alone can't stop heroin. But she's glad to know she's not the only one fighting. Law enforcement in Pueblo carry Narcan. That is a drug that's used to help people who have overdosed on heroin. Now, last year, 2015, the Pueblo Fire Department had to use that 140 times. And recently, Colorado Springs police have also started carrying Narcan. And since the program's inception a few months ago, they've used it one time. In Pueblo, Emily Allen Cardio, News Channel 13.